Hi guys, it's the Mills UP here and competitive football is back. Today is the first game of the season. We've got Watford at home, but before we make our way to the den, let's have a look at today's opposition. Watford managed by Tom Cleverley, of course, had quite a poor season last year. And online, all I've been hearing about Watford, you know, are bad things. So I don't think their fan base anyway are going into this season with much confidence. Of course, today is Sarkic's Memorial Day, so it will be nice to pay our respects to him today. So without further ado, let's get ourselves to SE16 and let's get the three points for Matija, shall we? Come, you Lions. As you can see, I've arrived at the Den. Team moves is out. And I'll be honest, I'm not too sure about the lineup. You know, Ete Stein, which, you know, I'm always happy to see him starting. But there's no Langstaff in the starting 11. And most importantly, no Idemar and Matthew, which I'm very disappointed about. But yeah, my score prediction for this game I can't remember the last time we didn't win an opening game. And I can't remember the last time we lost to Watford. So I am very confident today. I'm going to go for a score line of Millwall 2, Watford and Neil. Come your line. One May socket, there's only one May socket. One May socket. on the clock and still no improvement. We've been quite worryingly bad to be honest. Half time at the den, Millwall nil, Watford won, and wow, that was really, really going forward. Winners, absolutely winners. Two takeaways from the half is you know, I think Jensen, unfortunately, is a bit of a liability. Even against Southampton, he made a big mistake that led to a goal. And the other takeaway is that, you know, I hate to say it, but the more I think about it, the more I think, you know, SA is a bit too poor to really be starting in championship pictures. You know, yeah, just poor decision making at times. But yeah, moving on to the second half. Bring on Ida by Maku, and I think we'll have a chance to get back into it. Come you guys. Sorry to quickly interrupt the video, guys, but I just wanted to shout out our channel sponsor for this season, Just Drainage Services, which is owned by a Millwall fan, which serves Greater London and all surrounding areas. They offer a flat fee of 120 quid an hour. No hidden fees with 24-7 fast responses. 
their engineers have seen it all no job too big for them no job too small for them so if you've got drainage problems you know where to go the link to their website is in the description below enjoy the rest of the video <laughs> Yeah, because that's not gone in. <laughs> Gotta say, we started the first half like Prime Macbeth and Stanley. This second half, we started off like Prime Barcelona. We are in the front foot, but still no, still no goal to show for it. It's Mill with Mill, Watford 2. Blimey, like we started the second half off so well as well. Ah. Don't know what to say, mate. Don't know what to say. Get it on camera. A shot, it got deflected in. <laughs> a Watford player just latched onto it, headed it in. I don't know why Insta didn't come out to get the ball. dramatic game of football that was then it is really frustrating because i did think you know in the second half we were really good it's just simple as this we was not clinical enough and i did think some poor goalkeeping definitely did let us down today but one thing i will say is idemo maku must start next league game no excuses whatsoever and also guys next week i am going on holiday so there will be no match content you know over the next few weeks so i'll see you guys in a few weeks' time, I guess. Come, you lions. <laughs>